Hey guys, how's it going? Helping with tech here, and today I'm going to be talking about the new BlackBerry Playbook. So this new BlackBerry Playbook is going to be the BlackBerry Tablet, and uh, I think that it definitely does look very cool, and it's definitely going to be something that you might want to go check out. So this new BlackBerry uh, Playbook is uh, going to be released, I believe, in early 2011. Not too sure, and uh, I'm going to be telling you guys some of the specs that it has, and it really does seem like a pretty cool new device that they're going to be releasing. <clears throat> so one of the best new features that it's going to have, and this is, by the way, BlackBerry's first tablet, one of the best new features is it's going to have two HD cameras. Um, I know the iPhone does and the iPod Touch, but um, this one, or these cameras are going to be much better, and uh, compared to the iPad, since they're both tablets, this tablet actually does look pretty cool, and I'll talk about a bit of a comparison at the end of the video. But yeah, it's going to shoot 1080p HD video on the back, I believe, and I'm not sure on the front, but I know the back will shoot 1080p, which is very good. Um, it will also have HDMI output, which if you guys don't know what that is, it'll allow you to put HD videos from your tablet or uh, playbook, playpad, onto your TV and it'll be in HD and everything and look really nice. Another cool thing about it is that it will actually support flash, which the iPad doesn't. The iPad does not support flash still, which is pretty much sad for Apple, but uh, BlackBerry has definitely came out with something big, and it's not just a half-done project. This is a legit thing, and it's going to be a good... Uh, it's going to be a good rival to the iPad. Another thing, you know, of course it's going to have Wi-Fi and Bluetooth, but one thing I'm not sure, I think it might actually have 3G. There might be a 3G model, but do not quote me on that. I'm not sure about that, guys. It is 7 inches, uh, just like the iPad, and uh, it's also light and thin, and, uh, you know, it's going to be a really cool little thing, like I keep on saying. this is I'm pretty excited about this. I doubt I'm going to get it because I doubt I'm going to actually be able to afford it. And again, pricing, not sure about the price right now. Another awesome thing is that it's going to have a gigabyte of RAM. So you should, and it's going to have much more cool things like that. So when you're on this, you should not run to any problems when you're using it. It should be all smooth and it should just be a great, just overall it should be great. We'll have multitasking and also it will have BlackBerry Messenger. And so to sort of get back on the HD camera thing, guys, uh, since it will have a camera on the front and back, it definitely does look like it's going to have some type of chat or like something like FaceTime for BlackBerry devices. And then now I'm starting to think the next BlackBerry is going to have two cameras, and, you know, I think this is going to be really awesome. And BlackBerry and Apple are really going to start, uh, you know, being a rival to each other. They already are a bit in phones, but now the new tablet and everything... I'm interested to see what goes on, but I know a lot of people uh, do like Apple much more. Lots of people like BlackBerry, but I think Apple does have the upper hand. The multitasking, guys, like I said before, but this one seems much better than the iPad, and uh, the iPad is running iOS, and this BlackBerry, uh, BlackBerry Playbook is actually going to be running its own iOS, and uh, I'm not sure what it's called yet or anything like that, but... Like I said, this is going to be a really cool thing to go check out in the future, guys. Now, last but not least, you know, I wanted to talk about, like I said, iPad versus BlackBerry. And I have been doing it throughout the whole video. But, I mean, FaceTime and everything like that, which hopefully the new iPad does have when it comes out, whenever they release it. But um, this one, this BlackBerry Playbook, really does look like it's going to have all the features that the iPad is missing. Um... I mean, some of you might be saying, you know, there's not going to be any good apps for the BlackBerry. Guess what? They're coming out with a new SDK so developers can start making apps for the BlackBerry right away. Now, obviously, they're not going to have as many as the iPad does right now because it's not even out yet. But, you know, give it time and uh, we'll just see what happens. And if you guys are looking to purchase a tablet, honestly, I would definitely wait for the new iPad to come out, the, the recent iPad. Really, it's cool, but I mean, the new one's going to be much nicer. And also, there's going to be a more cool tablets like this BlackBerry one right here. 
So thanks for watching, guys. This was Helping with Tech. Hopefully you guys did like this video. And uh, I'll catch you guys later. So thanks for watching. And please subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And don't forget to like this video. It really helps me out. Peace.